Hi, it is the human operating system time. So I got a request from our Wing Chun friends asking me to share an overview of the uh, sticking body short strike, our Wing Chun sticking body short strike. And after seriously think about it, I make a decision to share with you how the Chinese martial art evolved and how Wing Chun evolved uh, until today. So that you be able to see what is going on in this historic evolutions before I present what is a sticking body short strike. It is really important or critical to know the evolutions to uh, a degree of uh, details so that uh, we know what is going on. Okay. And of course, uh, this will involve a lot of uh, gray area where people usually don't talk about. And so today I'm going to share with you this so that everybody here on know even the gray area, what is going on. And we are not making wrong of anyone, but we want to know what is going on, okay? Only we know what is going on, we can proceed. Now, that is a concept or there is a, a saying in Zen, Zen which uh, we always heard, and that is one cannot step on the same flowing water twice. Meaning the flowing water of the river, you cannot step on the same flowing water twice. The reason I bring this up is because the past already passed. Whatever Wing Chun in 1850s is already past, is gone. Today is no longer 1850. Wing Chun can only progress like the flowing water. We can no longer step on the, 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 flowing, the same flowing water of 1850 twice because everything changed in this world. So do not have a concept that uh, the ancients is the most advanced. The ancients is perfect. The ancient is ultimate. That is not real reality. Things change. We all changes. Okay? So what I want to present to you is we know what is the uh, past so that we can proceed continues on. It's not that we want to go back to the past. Okay. Now, uh, let's start on this, this history stuff. Okay. Today, when we talk about Wing Chun, we talk about, oh, there's a Ji Sim, there's a Ng Mui, and then, uh, there is this uh, Shaolin temple and then uh, there is this uh, legends of Wing Chun uh, was forced to marry the bad guy and then in the recent few decades it start to get up this mind power uh, 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 Taiji circular this fudging all this kind of stuff. This is what today, you know, we, if we in general, if we talk about Wing Chun, all this come up. Now, if we go back, we want to see where is this thing comes up. Is it still a court to what it is once upon a time? That is the key of the research and investigations. The key is not to go to, say, Fatsan, interview everybody. And then you come back, 
you become a, a grandmaster because you have interviewed so many people. That's not the key. And that's not what grandmaster is about. I still remember in 2000, year 2000, when there's a Wing Chun meal list. When most people uh, want to do research in Wing Chun, go to Canton, China. And I go to Shanghai. I go to the Tian Chun Tang of Shanghai or the Little Knife Society. Okay? Because we are doing research, we are not just interview anybody and thinking that uh, we know it. Okay? So, I like to share with you, start from here. So you can see the big picture of what is going on with the entire Chinese martial arts and you can know why is Wing Chun uh, evolved up to today? How is this going on here? And of course I'm not perfect but in the big picture, in the dominant the dominant uh, directions, we actually know what is going on. Because right now we are in an information uh, era where we can piece everything up. Okay? So to begin with, this word, okay, to begin to share with you this, maybe I should wear this one. So you can trust me because I am the Darth Vader, you know, I am the, uh, the dark side uh, or the Jedi who turned dark side. Oh, just joking with you guys, okay. So, we want to start in 1930s. We want to start at 1930s. At 1930s, Ma Li Tang and many traditional Chinese martial arts, Sifu, in the uh, northern China start to say they want a reform. Okay, Ma Li Tang, okay, who is a Xing Yi, he's a very uh, uh, expert in, in Qigong and so forth, and the uh, traditional Chinese martial art uh, doctor for the top, uh, the, the communist party's general, okay, and of course, at 1930, communists still uh, not take over or rule the China, China yet, okay, and it's just the beginning of revolutions, people want change, because the country is problematic. So Ma Li Tang and many of the Chinese martial artists, they want reform. So there are three things they want to take out from the traditional Chinese martial at that time, okay? The first thing is to take out that the claiming of my style is the best, my lineage is the best. Take that out. The second is to take away those mysterious power stuff. Fa Jing, I have the mysterious power. The third thing is to take away the Chinese martial art uh, performance like the opera or on the stage. So these three things is what the Ma Li Tang and, 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 the, and this group of, uh, of, of, of uh, Chinese martial artists want to take out. Because at that time, Ma Li Tang and his group of people is facing the challenge of the martial artists from Japan and the Western. Okay? You read history, you can see that. Okay? Now, so they want to take out, I am right, my, my style is the best, my lineage is the most authentic. They want to take out all this mysterious fudging stuff. The third thing is no more the stage performance, okay? 
Chinese martial art has to be like in the ancient, it be able to uh, strengthen one's body or makes one's body more healthier and it need to be able to fight because these people, this group people, Mali Tang group people fought with the the, 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 the challenge from the West and Japan. So they know what is going on, okay? Now, so this is 100, is, uh, today is 2020, 90 years ago, so almost 100 years ago, okay? So 100 years ago, this already happened. People already know what is going on, know that these three things are trouble, okay? Now let, let me tell you a little bit of who is Ma Li Tang. Ma Li Tang, okay, so Grandmaster Ma Li Tang, he is the student of Tu Xing Wu. Tu Xing Wu. So who is Tu Xing Wu? Tu Xing Wu is one of the revolutionists who, uh, uh, who, 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 who tip the, 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 the Qing dynasty, okay? Who, who tip the, the Qing dynasty, Tu Xing Wu. So, at one point, Tu Xing Wu went to assassins, the last emperor of the uh, the last empress of Qing Dynasty, Cixi, Empress Cixi, Tu Xing Wu, because uh, 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 the, the 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 last empress is just really corrupted and a lot of things screwy. Tu Xing Wu went to assassin him, uh, her. The assassin not success. He become a wanted person. He went to Japan. And later he become the bodyguard of Dr. Sun Yat-sen. The guy who overthrown the Qing dynasty. If you live in San Francisco, you can still see the uh, Dr. Sun Yat-sen's, uh, you can see Dr. Sun Yat-sen's uh, statue there and uh, the, 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 the uh, meeting place there, you know, in San Francisco. So, so, so Ma Li Tang is the student of Tu Xing Wu and Tu Xing Wu is the bodyguard of Sun Yat-sen, the first president of uh, the, the, the China after overthrown the Qing dynasty. And then, uh, that is uh, <coughs> that's how it is. Okay, <coughs> now, <coughs> so this group of people, they are revolutionists. They they want to change. They want to reform because, in their idea, China need to be like Japan, have a reform. It's not just to kill somebody or or, or uh, to do some uh, uh, private uh, personal revenge. No, you need to reform the entire thing. Like the, 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 the Japanese reform, only that way you have a hope. Okay, so this is 100 years ago. Now, why is important that I tell you this? It's because we already know 100 years ago, all these lineages, this uh, mind uh, uh, style is the best style, the ultimate style. Uh, the, uh, the, 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 the magic fudging, okay, and then there's a uh, very uh, artistic, like a uh, uh, opera type of move. It's problematic and, and, and traditional Chinese martial arts have already run out, divert from the main course of the Chinese martial art where strengthen the body and be able to fight or defend oneself, okay? Now, so this is 100 years ago, people already know. Now let's get to 1660s. 
Okay. So, 1660s. This is the time of the downfall. The downfall of Ming Dynasty. So, Qing Dynasty started. Okay, Qing Dynasty started at this time. And we need to know that General Qi Qi Guang is 1560. So, this is General Qi Qi Guang and his army and so forth. His, uh, his, his uh, war technology. So by 1660, this already changed into the Qing Dynasty. Okay? Now, This is China. So this is Taiwan, today Taiwan. This is China. This is the northern China, China. this is the southern China, as where we are is here in Canton, Fujian, over here, okay? over here okay Shanghai okay so far okay check the the uh, the, 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 the map you know, I, I didn't draw it properly I just say that this is southern and northern this is Taiwan okay so what happened when the Ming dynasty people lost their war the the, the army lost their war they going south. They going south. Okay, so the the the, the Qing, the Qing win, and then they uh, the, the 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 Ming army and general lost. So that they going south. And then when they going south. At that time, that is the Zhen Chen Gong, okay, fleet. To Taiwan, fleet to Taiwan, okay. So whatever with the general Qi Ji Guang and all this uh, martial art and this military stuff, go to Taiwan, okay. And then what happened is this. What happened is. The General Zheng Chen Gong in Taiwan, they formed the anti-Qing. They formed the anti-Qing. So they sent people back to the southern of China. Okay? And when they sent people back to the southern China, a lot of story is created. The name Ng Wei. Is created. So if you check into the Chinese martial, you can see mui here, mui there, mui there. You can have ten zillion mui because those are created by this anti Qing. No, of course they don't want you to. They don't want to do to the Qing to know who the world they are. Okay, because the Qing is tracking them down. Okay. And they make use of the Shaolin. They make use of the religions to spread the anti Qing. The Shaolin is very different than the, 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 the real Buddhism Shaolin of, of uh, the, the Shaolin of the real Zen Buddhism, where it is a different, it is a different type of uh, uh, the Shaolin. And uh, like Ngui, they are living in the propagations or the story or the legends of this anti-Qing. Now, 
whatever this is inherit from Qi Qi Guang, general Qi Qi Guang, is packaged and put into this new stories and and uh, and and uh, and and legends and martial arts system. They're still using the 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 the, the Qi Qi Guang, but they don't mention it anymore. Why? Well. General Qi Qi Guang is a hero, general of the Ming dynasty. The Qing will not like to hear on that. And when you go to Taiwan and you bring it back, you don't want to mention General Qi Qi Guang. Because you don't want your, your, your head get chopped off, okay? What, what, you know, when the Qing is tracking the, the, the Ming, the anti-Qing people, and then you don't say, well, you know, according to General Qi Qi Guang of Ming Dynasty, well, you're going to put yourself into trouble. That's why now it, uh, the, 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 in Taiwan, the story of Mui, Shaolin, all this repackage, and you can, you can track down things that they are still using the Ming, the General Qi Qi Guang technology. Okay, so to be specific, 1726, the Emperor Yongzhen, the Emperor Yongzhen of the Qing Dynasty, okay, so 1660, sometimes like this, he, they take over, and then the 1726, it issued a law to ban practice of martial arts, ban competitions of martial arts. The 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 the, uh, the 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 Yongzhen, and as today you can heard about the story of what, the burning of Shaolin Temple. The time they burn, uh, they they, because you know it is political, right? This is a new country, a new new dynasty, is going to control, and is going to execute whoever, have a, you know, uh, against them. So that's what happened. And so that's why you don't heard about Qi Ji Guang much anymore. Of course, in Taiwan, those generals went there and so forth. You know, this, this Qi Ji Guang stuff is uh, people know. Okay? Now, on the other hand, Japan and Korea or Okinawa, Korea, they don't have that problem. They don't have the political problem of the Qing dynasty. Well, so they know uh, this is from Qi Ji Guang. So they keep that. Okay, now. So. So this is China. This is Taiwan. And, uh. This is the general Qi Ji Guang stuff uh, or the Ming Dynasty uh, stuff. After he get to Taiwan, it repackaged by the uh, 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 anti Qing, it spread back to the southern China. And here you only heard about the Shaolin, the burning of the Shaolin, the uh, Ng Mui, the uh, Qi Xim. Okay, since 16, uh, late 1600 or 1700, okay, they spread that thing. And it's easy to use Buddhism to spread this thing, right? You know, always that you know that when you want to overturn the government or anything, they use religions. It's all politics, okay? Now, so that has been there. In, uh, in, uh, in, in, in southern China and the management system is well it is the anti-Qing uh, 
group by group, right? So that uh, you belong to this group, you have this martial art, you have belong to that group, you, can, you have that type of martial art. Okay. So, from say, you know, 16, late 1600, late 1600, 17, early 1700, to 1840s. This all going on. Okay. This all going on. So, so this is China, mainland. This is Taiwan. So from say late sixteen hundred to eighteen forties, all this anti Qing thing is going on. Is spreading here. So you have different martial art, and then today you can say, oh, my art is mui, and your art is mui. So mui, uh, like uh, this one mui will invent or create Wing Chun and other art, other art. Well, that's, 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 that's unreliable at all. The, those are just cowered up by the anti-Qing so that they don't get tracked down by the Qing. And then also they have their identity because they different be, belong to different groups of anti-Qing. So, so, 1840. Why 1840s? Because 1840s, at that time, that is an opium war. And that the, the, the anti-Qing start again. Okay? Now, so, say we are here in Fatsan, in Canton area, the Wing Chun uh, ancestor. So, at that time, by 1850s time, 40s, 50 times, our ancestor in fine jade associations is, uh, 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 how to say that, is, uh, is, is, uh, is uh, allied with Hong Seng Choi Lei Fai and many other uh, tra traditional Chinese martial arts style in Fatsan area supporting the Taiping uprising and have the uh, the, the, the anti-Qing uprising so as uh, the well-known uh, the Red Book uprising led by Li Man Mao of Red Book okay and uh, our ancestor Yip Kam is there okay so in the 1850s, there's uprising. And what I know from Fatsan is at that time, Dr. Leong Zhan is very likely participate in that uprising too. Because Dr. Leong Zhan's name <coughs> is not Leong Zhan. He fled out of Fatsan for many years before he come back. Okay. So so at the uprising, after the uprising, uh, the, 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 the Wing Chun uprising lost. Okay. At that time, the Qing is using the British army with, uh, with, with guns to fight them. And at that time, it is business, right? So uh, the, 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 the British army do not uh, go to the site of the Taiping, instead go to the site of the Qing dynasty. So uh, that's what happened. You can read in the history. Okay. So after the 1860, okay, So this is this is uh, the, the, the the Canton area, okay. This is this is uh, where our Wing Chun ancestor is, in the eighteen sixties, uh, okay. After the loss of the the loss of the, uh, the, the 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 uprising, the Red Book uprising, where a lot of our ancestor passed away 
died, okay, and uh, some have to flee away. And uh, at the we need to know that at the 1840s, 1850s time, when Marcia is trained in the fine jade associations of the Red Boat Opera, it is not a homogeneous. Okay, it is not homogeneous, meaning that say you train Wing Chun in that uh, in the uh, Red Boat Opera Association, the Fine Jet Associations. It depends on which Sifu you train or which leader of the anti Ching you train with. What you learn is different. And there are document, document of the people who is in this fine jade associations some of them even train for only two days and they were sent to the battle zone okay so so that is a research in fatsan today they know this okay so it's non homogeneous okay by that time this uh, this uh, this uh, Wing Chun, Hong Sing, Chui Lei Fat, and many other uh, the traditional Chinese martial arts, because they belong to anti Qing, they are allied the anti the Qing, and after the loss of the Red Boat uh, uprising, the Fine Jade get closed down. Okay, and uh, so there's no opera. Uh, show in, uh, in, 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 in Canton, in, in Fatsan area for, 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 for a decades, 13, 15 years or so, until the, the Qing allowed them to, uh, to, to restart this, this opera group. And they are no, no longer the fine jade, they are the Pak War opera group. So, so the Pak War is not anti-Qing. The guy who is anti-Qing is the fine jade, King Fa. We good, okay. Now, something happened after eighteen sixties. After eighteen sixties, after the war, Choi Le Fat still in the people's sight. He, it, they are still in the people's sight, okay. Many of the Wing Chun. Ancestor today we know no longer in the anti Qing side, but working here for the rich people as bodyguard or the Qing officer because the political climax changing and so forth. So many of the Wing Chun ancestor today we know actually they already. Uh, working for the Qing or the rich people as the bodyguard, okay? And as we can see that, uh, if you look at the people who study Chua Lei Fat, they never touch opium. But you look at the, our Wing Chun ancestor, how many of them touch opium? You know what, what is going on there. And actually that is a political, uh, 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 always a, a fight between these two group of people. Because the Chai is, is 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 for the people, and uh, these people they change. They do not no longer follow what their ancestor in the Red Boat against the Qing. Well, we cannot blame people because it is a society. The key is survival. It is a really chaotic uh, society uh, survival. The Chai people take a lot of hit. Okay. A lot of sacrifice and the Wing Chun you know different people have their different group and school and so forth so so this school uh, it is uh, it is say the Yi Zi Pai okay they belong to this uh, this group of people now so at this time you see it already very far away from the, uh, the, the, the repackaging of Taiwan from uh, General Zheng Chen Gong. Okay, 
then uh, then, then go. Okay, it's very far away already. So nobody, or we we should say that. The name of a uh, Chi Guang and the uh, Shaolin Sword Strike and so forth will be, will be rare. Okay, at, at this instance, because what they got over here, you know, after two hundred years already, or one hundred something years already since seventeen hundred to eighteen fifties and eighteen sixties. This is one hundred sixty years there already. So the the the, the Chi Chi Guang and so forth is a. Uh, it's rarely heard, and also the educations and the political climax of the uh, of the of the uh, Ming, uh, sorry, of the Qing, which is which is uh, the 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 uh, the enemy of the Ming, you know. And education rhetoric here is that by by the time eighteen sixties, it's very hurt, rarely heard really. So. Eighteen sixties, okay. So, say this is CLF, the Chile Fight people, Hong Sing Chile Fight people. This is the Wing Chun people, and uh, this become many group. Okay, and uh, because uh, different people have different political, uh, you know, uh, uh, view, and this belong to the Yi Zi. Okay. Uh, martial arts school, okay, which is you now they're anti, they they are not uh, get along with the Chile fight. You can read their history, okay. So, at that time, at this time, more story is created, more story is created. Okay, like the story of fighting with the uh, Chile fight and all kinds of style, and then uh, the, the the legends of uh, the Mui. Uh, was in the red boat, or the Chi Sim is in the red boat of eighteen sixties, uh, teaching uh eighteen forties, you know, teaching the uh, the, the, the red boat people. Well, you look at that. When you talk about Chi Sim and so forth, that is the seventeen hundred people. How come that is doing a time time travel one hundred fifty years ago, uh, or one hundred thirty years later, uh, show up in the uh, King Fa, the fine jade uh, uh, red boat, right? All those kind of style is creating here. And again, I'm revealing this is not to blame anybody, but to say that oh, this is this is what it is, okay? So it is here, and a more thing is uh, evolved, and then it get into 1950s. Okay, so that at that time you can you you get a lot of thing already a, a lot of uh, different evolutions of Wing Chun different lineages you can start to come up with different lineages, at the uh, at the eighteen uh, fifties uh, uh, there's only one Wing Chun, and then after the eighteen sixty you get many lineage by the by nineteen uh, fifties, you get. So many lineages of Wing Chun already. That's, that's how the lineage come. Okay? Now. 1950s. This is what I call the 1960 platform. Okay? It further evolved. Okay? So different, there are more lineages come up from 1950s. And the... Uh, one thing you can see is Bruce Lee. Bruce Lee break out from the 1960 platform and uh, because we still today can read this letter from Bruce Lee, what have he changed? Okay. So he said that uh, Though I am grateful for Wing Chun, the fact remains that the Jun, Zhen Fan is yet several steps ahead of the Wing Chun system. Where Wing Chun's end, Jun Fan starts not to add on but to see the isness with freedoms and in its 
totality. Bruce Lee's words. That is Bruce Lee's words. Okay. So we know that Bruce see issue here. That's why he said here. But to see is to see the isness with freedom and in its totality. Where Wing Chun and Jun Fan start. And he said that Jun Fan is yet several steps ahead of Wing Chun system. Well, what Bruce Lee means is the 1960s platform. It, Bruce Lee do not, by today, you look at his record, do not have the record of whatever from General Chi and the Shaolin short strike above. That's what it is. Okay, so he reformed. He, he, so that's why he, he, you know, he, just, he just formed his own as in the letter, Bruce Lee. And then there are other groups which is taking Taiji concept where it get into this mind power and internal, those kind of stuff. We go another direction. And of course, there's other, other directions. And thus, today we see so many different lineages. So this is how the, 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 the entire evolution come down. And that is why, but today, But today, 2019, you don't heard about General Chi Chi Guang. Well, the Okinawa tape, uh, uh, the, the, the Koreans still know about General Chi Chi Guang, still know about the Shaolin document and so forth. And we don't heard about that anymore. We just heard about this uh, Ji Sim Ngui create Wing Chun and all this legend and so forth. We don't even know about the, 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 the what happened between uh, 1860s to 1900. That, that gray area where uh, Wing Chun ancestor working for the Qing, for the rich people. And then they have to flip when uh, the uh, when the communists come in, and Chai Lefer is uh, is there um, for the people, and then uh, so there's all kind of political stuff. Okay, again, I'm not saying who is right, who is wrong. I'm saying that there's a lot of political there, and there's become gray area. That's why today's movie, you look at today's Wing Chun movie, right away it jumped into the Red Boat era, but it never tell you what happened after the loss of the Red Book Opera. Okay? That's why when I went to Fatsan, I go straight to go visit the Fine Jade uh, Associations of the Red Book Opera because that's where our ancestor is, the Wing Chun ancestor is. Okay, without those people, we, we don't have uh, an identity of who we are, okay? And that's why when I was in Fatsang, because at, after cultural revolutions, even other style do not understand us Wing Chun anymore. And so people ask me, and yes, people ask me this way, you know, the, the elderly from other style said, so what is Wing Chun great? What, what great is Wing Chun great about? What Wing Chun have done for the, for the people of China? Okay? Instead of just the movie, the old generation asking, yes, this is the question. And I show him, I show them the salutations of the Red Boat Opera. And I say that our ancestor fight in the battle too. And after that, they say, oh, I never heard about this. If this is the case, I respect Wing Chun. 
So, so in China today, okay, because of all this, this chaotic situations of past hundred years, this many thing is no longer there. And so we need to know this. Don't take me as, a, 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 as perfect. Don't trust whatever I say, but do research in that. Because this has to be clear. Okay? So, we like it or not, we are here today. We cannot no longer go back to the past. We like it or not, we know that the source, the source code of the, the art is from Qi Qi Guang, Qi Qi Guang influence Shaolin, Qi Qi Guang influence Okinawa, Qi Qi Guang influence Korea, Qi Qi, Qi Guang influence a lot of people. That is the source, the, the, the blood line. Okay? And we need to get back to that because it is a dead end. If you go to the, the Shaolin, the, uh, the, the Shaolin uh, legends, uh, which, is, uh, which is composed by the, uh, the, 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 the Zheng Chen Gong and Tai Qing group for their, uh, for their cow up and for them to protect their people who follow them. Because you don't want to say, yeah, I know I'm from Chi Chi Guang. See, see you get executed on Okay, so this is the entire thing I like to share with you before I get into the 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 the, the, the short strike Wing Chun. Okay, and I don't want to be here, you know, like dictating this stuff, and I don't want to be here like saying that my lineage is the best. You see, I never talk about any lineage. This is history. Okay, and we know, like Bruce Lee. He went out to uh, create his own style. And we know that people who, who, who imported uh, 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 Tai Chi concept into the, uh, into the, uh, the, 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 the Wing Chun after 1950s. Also one thing, the Qing Dynasty will love you now go back to the uh, 1930 revolutions. One of the things is that uh, all this magical power, get rid of that done magic, magical power. Well, politically, the Qing government will love you, Chinese, from the Ming descendant, to believe in the mysterious power. That's why you don't heard about Qi Ji Guang, you heard about all this Taoists. You have this mysterious power. Of course, the Qing are uh, the Qing like you. The Qing is a, a, a dynasty will say, okay, it's good. Because if you're keeping fantasy, you're not going to create problem for me. Well, the issue right now is you're keeping doing those kind of stuff where the Qing love um, on this mysterious stuff and all this stuff. Now in 2017, you have to face Xu Xiaodong of China, the MMA player. 2018, Wing Chun have to face that MMA of China. Okay, Xu Xiaodong. And Xu Xiaodong is saying that Oh, you know, I want to expose the fake martial arts. Well, Tai Chi is on target, Wing Chun is on target. Well, does it mean that Tai Chi is fake? Does it mean that uh, Wing Chun is fake? Of course it's not. The issue is we miss the evolutions or the reform in 1930. If that happened, you will not see this today. What, what happened in the, in the 2017 and uh, 2018. You will never see that, you, if this happened. The issue is, is after 1930s, after 1930s, China get into the inner war, Japanese invasion, cultural revolution, and thing wiped out, okay? So you know how, how political this thing is? Let me show you one thing.
This is uh, 1968. Okay, two years after the uh, Bruce Lee, Bruce Lee write his letter at the 1966. Okay, should be close here in Oakland, you know, 40 miles from where I sit here. Okay, May 23rd, 1966. And uh, what I'm going to show you here is 1968, April 26, in uh, the newspaper of celebrating Chairman Mao's uh, birthday. And this is saying, okay, this this is there. The translate is say that. Uh, Wishing Chairman Mao uh, happy birthday, Tai Chi Chuan. You get that political, okay? And uh, as in uh, other videos, I show you that uh, that uh, the, the 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 Grandmaster Xie Tian of uh, Xing Yi, okay. He was executed 1953. Okay. So uh, at the suppressing the suppressing activity of movement, he got executed. Well, it's obviously that you don't listen to me, you're gone. Okay. <coughs> so this is the reality. And and before I, I, I talk about the, 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 the short strike, uh, sticking by the short strike, I like you to have this background, okay? And you don't have to trust me, I don't want you to trust me. Check into the history, okay? And actually, there are many people doing this research, and uh, the research in China know many things too, but. Uh, a lot of information is not released because over here us in the West we can release informations uh, freely but uh, in uh, in Asia in China you still have the traditions and you have a different thing and that's why I compare note with a with a, with, with some researcher in Asia and say that this doesn't exist this doesn't exist or this doesn't make sense and and often they say yeah Hendrik we know we we check into this this network exists so so this is the reality okay and uh, so next time I'm going to or, or, or in the video of the uh, of the uh, skin sticking body short strike I'm going to using the Shaolin uh, uh, short strike document to, to explain to you what is sticking body short strike prior to the 1850s okay where the day is still using the package of the uh, General Chen Chen Kong from Taiwan and General Chen Chen Kong's technology actually is the General Chi Chi Kong's technology okay and also that is the reason I wrote this book. Okay, that's the reason I put the uh, I I put the uh, the the you know a uh, a uh, very well, you know the all the document from the the the, the Chi Chi Guang down so that we can track things, and we know that uh, like a uh, Pring Mantis has walked this path too. To, uh, to, to, to link up with the General Chi Chi Guang's document, and this this is the trend because we want to know what it is. Uh, uh, go through the anti Qing part and go into the the source. Okay. And uh, by the way, this book, if one is looking for a beautiful English. Or uh, a beautiful picture, don't buy this book. This book is released for uh, 
for solutions, to provide solutions, okay? Let me tell you two things which is you might not know. One thing is to, to transfer a culture, technology, uh, to different culture, like from the Chi Chinese to English. It is really tough. If you don't believe me, you go read this, uh, like uh, today you have a uh, uh, Tao De Jing, like the Tao De Jing, or, or, the, or, or, or the Chinese, translate into many versions of the Tao De Jing in English version today. You can, you can look at it. Beautiful photograph, uh, beautiful, nice, prone, right, uh, uh, beautiful English. If you read that thing, See whether you know what exactly the Chinese is talking about. Or that those are just opinion. Okay? So when I wrote Wing Chun Matrix, there is problem with, uh, with, uh, with, with, with the translations. Because now you, you want to transfer one thing from one culture to the other culture. Another thing have to do with editor. Editor, as all human, different people have their different view. And so I want to keep this as close to what you can find in the Chinese history. Otherwise it's meaningless. Okay? So if you want a, a, like a beautiful a, 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 a book like the Tao De Jing, uh, where there are nice English, beautiful English, and then the uh, the the, uh, the 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 photograph is is a high resolution. Don't buy this book. But if you want to know what's going on, and you want to know the solution, yes, this book provides a solutions. Not only one solution, many solutions, including the two C state, including the mapping. Of how things including the momentum and the short strike stuff those are solutions okay if you want to look for the solutions and you're willing to think and to figure out what happened like you know it is looking for a tech technical uh, answer and solution then this book is for you but if you want to buy this book, uh, expect it like uh, 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 the, the Tao De Jing book, forget about it, okay? You're buying a wrong book. As for the, 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 the cause of uh, this book, somebody said, you know, have bad English, you know, so uh, why you charge this much? Well, and somebody said, well, you live in Silicon Valley, don't you know that? Okay, let me tell you, this book, if by its value, its value and not educations it will be charged much much more than the price now because it is educations and it has to cover the cost and not many too many people will buy the book there's a cost and so forth there so I make it a low price otherwise it will be a few X at least Okay, and uh, because the value is not uh, not about how thick this book is, it is the solutions, and uh, just to be to be to be straight with you. Just this three C uh, two C state alone, this two C state alone. Those who go through it know what. How is the solution make a heaven and earth difference? Just the two C state fully described in the book. Not to mention other momentum still, uh, stuff, okay? So if I want to use a Silicon Valley value system of a pricing, where, hey, you know, if you don't have the solution, you need the solution, how much you're going to pay? then it's not going to charge in this today's cost. It will be much higher. Today is for education, so everybody knows this. Okay? 
if you because it is a heaven and earth difference whether one is in the 2C or not in 2C. Many have gone through it and many have experienced it. Okay. So this is to share with you uh, today and uh, what I'm going to I'm going to go into the uh, the the, uh, the 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 sticking body short strike. You know when when I'm ready for that one. And uh, the 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 next video the, that that video and this book, they are covering the 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 the, uh, the same material of the ancient. And in the video, I can show you some more different things, and the details you can see more in the books. Okay. So that's how I like to uh to 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 share on what happened prior to this 1850s. So we can evolve. We can never go back. As the water, we cannot step twice. And you see, talented genius like Bruce, he see issue there with the platform. That's why he go his way. Okay? And uh, you might see platform in the 1850s too. And you might evolve. And that's how the, 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 the Wing Chun continue to evolve, uh, to evolve and, uh, and, uh, and, 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 uh, and progress. Okay? So this is to share with you today.